Fun Sunday fun day, everybody. It has been a really interesting Sunday. We are actually in Portland, Oregon right now because this morning after getting my drone shots, I was coming down. I didn't crash it, but While I've had the drone, I have had a few landing mishaps, I'll call it. I don't know what your definition is of a crash, but for me a crash is just completely destroying it. But I have had some landing mishaps where the blades tend to hit a branch or something, like really close to the ground. Rookie mistakes. There's a silver propeller and a black propeller. They rotate opposite directions and only the silver propellers will go where the silver propellers are supposed to go and only the black propellers are, can go where the black propellers are supposed to go. Anyways, every single time this mishap has happened, it's always been the black propeller. I don't know why, but I've ran out of spares. So I headed into Portland to a Best Buy to pick up some spares. First off today, getting new freaking propellers. I had to get them, otherwise I won't have the drone. I have new ones coming in. I ordered a bunch, but they're not going to be here until Wednesday or Thursday, I believe. I did make a lizard friend this morning, though, and that was really cool. It's like in the 40s right now. Come on, buddy. Need help? Oh, uh, man, I wish I could. Maybe I should move you off the road. Here, let's go over here. I don't want you to die from a car. Second off today, there was actually a video going around on Facebook a while back about the Tamalich Blue Pool. I don't know if I'm saying it right. Tamalich, Tamalich Blue Pool. This beautiful blue pool about two and a half hours away. The video I saw, in my opinion, didn't do it justice. I think I could do a lot better. So tomorrow, I would like to do that. Today, I want to start heading that way. I had to stop quick, the sunset's so gorgeous. The sun's going down so fast, why does it do that? Oh man. The sun goes down extra fast when you're trying to capture it. It was so gorgeous a minute ago. I caught the rainbow at least, there was a rainbow out there. That was pretty gorgeous too. I missed it. I was too late. It was beautiful though. Just just take my word for it, I guess. But I got new blades at least for tomorrow. Made it to Salem, Oregon. I'm gonna have myself a steak potato and egg tonight. Also, I need to pick up something here too. Something important. One of these bad boys right here. Oh, This is a seven gallon versus the five gallon that's in the Jeep right now. Also, the spigot on my five gallon one, it's the weak point. I've changed that spigot out three times. This one's hideaway, it's supposed to be stronger. I don't know, might as well try it. It's BPA free, so I mean, it's gotta be good, right? A couple extra gallons of water, we'll see how it lasts. We'll see how the spigot lasts. Ooh, what is this? Coleman. Ooh, that might be a nice upgrade. It's got some springs on there. A little flexibility. Oh, yeah. Comes with a little pad on there. Steel frame versus my aluminum one that I have. It's very tempting. I got it. Now let's see if it actually fits. I guess it was about time I replaced that freaking thing. By some divine miracle, she actually fit. I am so pumped right now. I am gonna sleep like a king tonight. 
Living large in my new bed. Check out the new and improved jade. I also get two extra inches of leg room with this bad boy too. Dang, I'm so pumped to just test it out tonight. I had to do a little rearranging underneath, but not too shabby. Got my seven gallon water container set up. Everything fits. The tailgate will actually close. And the door closes too. And that's what you need to fit the car in the Jeep. This frame is steel versus the aluminum one. And every time I would get in, it would just bend it more and more. I literally would sometimes slide down because it's bent so bad. Four months of use right there. Every time I'd get in, just bend a little bit more. While I had this cut out, I actually had a chance to clean up the Jeep a little bit. This is all garbage that was in there, just collecting underneath the cot and wherever else I could find a crack or crevice. Honestly, never had complaints about the old one, but this will be a night and day difference, I guarantee it. I'll give an update in tomorrow's vlog on how I actually slept on it. Third off today, second off, fourth off, find somewhere to camp. Perfect. Got the taters are cooking. Once they're done, I gotta throw on the eggs and the beef, don't you know? Now that is comfort. Wow, just sitting on it feels so good. Yep. I think I'm gonna sleep really, really good tonight. I have a feeling. Holy. Oh, I caught it. Before I let you guys go tonight, I have a very special thank you, and that is to my newest Patreon pledge. Whom is Michael Lewis? Michael, thank you so much for being my newest Patreon pledge. Tomorrow we go find this Tamalich blue pool, knock on roof. Should be a good time, and uh, pretty freaking pumped. As always, Wranglers, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I'll see you guys tomorrow.